Good day, everyone. Welcome to our maths class. Today, we are going to talk about time or telling time in the nearest minute. For our starter activity, I would like you to write the time shown on each clock. Pause the video and write your answers. Time is up. Now let's reveal the answers. For the clock one, the answer is 23 minutes to 5. For clock 2, we got 18 minutes past 4. And for the clock 3, we have 2 minutes past 3. Did you get the correct answers? Good job. If not, stay tuned and listen carefully for this topic. Our learning objective for this morning is to tell and write the time to the nearest minute. Success criteria. I can tell and write the time to the nearest five minute. I can tell and write the time in minutes past the hour. I can tell and write the time in minutes to the hour. And I can solve problems involving time. How are we going to tell time to the nearest minute? Yesterday, we have learned that a clock has two parts. The right part of the clock are the past minutes and the left part of the clock is the two minutes to the next hour. If we are counting the number of minutes past, that is on the clockwise. If we are counting the minutes to the next hour, that is counterclockwise or anticlockwise. Now, let's take this as example. What time is it? We all know that the long hand tells about the minutes and the short hand tells about the hour. Telling the time in words, we say the minutes first before the hour. So count the number of the minutes past because it is on the right side. So we have 5, 10, 15 and an extra dot that makes it 16. So it is 16 past 3. Let's see if I'm correct. 16 minutes past 3. Correct. How about this time? What time is it? Okay, it's still on the past side. Again, we'll count each number by 5 intervals. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22. So it's already 22 past, what is the hour? 11. So 22 minutes past 11. That's correct. Now it's your turn. Write the time on each clock. Pause the video and write your answers. Time is up. Now let's see if your answers are correct. Clock number one, it is six minutes past four. Clock number two, it is 21, 22. Okay, so it is 25, 26, 27, 28 minutes past seven. And for the clock number three, we have five, 10, 11, 12, 13 minutes past five. Are your answers correct? Well done. Now, let's read the, the clock by the minutes to the hour. Now, let's focus on the two sides. Okay, so from 12, we count anticlockwise to the left, starting with 12, 5 to 11, 10, 15 or quarter, 20, 25 to the next hour. Okay? So, for example, we have this clock. It is already on the two sides. So, let's count backward. 5, 10, 15, plus 1, 16, 2. Okay, we say it. 16 minutes to the next hour. So, this next hour after 2 is 3. Therefore, the time now is 16 minutes to 3. Let's see if the answer is correct. Yes, we are correct. How about this clock? What time is it? 
So it's again in the two sides. So from 12, we count 1, 2, 2 minutes to 9, 2 minutes to 9. Perfect. Now it's their turn. Write the time on each clock. Pause the video and write your answers. Time is up. Now let's see if your answers are correct. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. 26, 27, 28. 28 minutes to 5. That's correct. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 minutes to 1. And finally, we have 5, 10, 11 minutes to 8. Perfect. I hope you get all the correct answers. Now, Let's have this clock. The clock is already divided to two parts, the two and the past side. Now, pause the video and match the clock to the time it is shown. Pause the video and write your answers. Okay, time is up. Let's reveal the answers. So it is on the two sides, so we have five, Six, seven, eight, nine minutes to six. Nine minutes to six, it's here. Good job. Now, on this side, it is in the past side. So it's five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, past three. So we have here the answers. It's again. For clock number three, it's on the past side. Five, five, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23 minutes past 10. And finally, for the next clock, it's 14 minutes to 5. Okay, it's on the two sides. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 minutes to 5. I hope you have learned something today. Thank you so much for listening and watching my video. Till next time, always remember, be the best you can. Bye!